Hunter, uh, we were, you know, we were on the road so much, we'd watch it the uh, Saturday, uh, the, I think it was called Main Event back then, the WCW Main Event. And, our, and me and uh, Sean's favorite wrestler was Terror Rising, who was fucking, that was, was Hunter's fucking deal. Yeah. When he was at WCW, he was Terror Rising. So you, know, you always got the, your favorite guys on the other shows, you know, because especially guys that aren't getting used. Right. <laughs> and uh, we were in, like, Wooster or someplace like that, and Kowalski came in, and Hunter came in with him. And, uh, you know, he had, like, a fucking sports coat and slacks on and shit, and we're like, like this motherfucker. But we knew it was terrorizing. He had that long fucking, you know, Fabio hair and shit. Yeah. So he had his tryout match. And uh, we all sat there at the fucking monitor. Fucking Scott looked back at me and said, that fucking motherfucker's money. He walked out of the ring and fucking Scott was like walking step for step, like fucking maybe a three feet behind him, kind of fucking being a goof. And, you know, Paul turned around, looked at him and fucking, he said, you know, he said, you ride with? He said, I'm with Walter. He says, not next week. <laughs> next week, he said, you, you ride with us. And then we found out that he didn't drink or do anything. Right. He didn't drink, take pills, didn't do shit. It was like, fuck, yeah, it doesn't it? Because my big ass has been driving them fuckers around for like two years, you know. I was like, fuck this. <laughs> but then she it, it, it got to, we're, you know, we're on the road for so much that, uh, and this is the, the kind of shit that, that kills me is, you, remember how you used to be, you used to pack for 16 fucking days. Right. You know? And you have these giant hockey bags and all this fucking shit. And then one day, me and Hunter were sitting there, and I said, "Fucking!" And we, 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 and one thing about Paul was that he loved to train, and I loved to train. So we always went to the gym together. We, you and I always went to the gym together. There's gym guys, there's and there's the not gym guys. The gym guys always fucking drive together. That's just the way it is. And uh, so, and you know, sometimes Sean would train, sometimes, but you know, Sean and. Uh, Scott and Kid, you know, Kid wasn't much of a trainer, and uh, but Scott and uh, Sean would fucking, you know, be hung over from the night before, and they'd go in there and do dips and pull-ups. You know, that's all they'd do. Right. And, we'd like, Fuck, I, and, and, and they'd be done in, you know, 20 minutes, and we'd go catch a tan and go and have a, a, a fucking protein drink and try to push you through the gym. So I was like, fuck this. So finally, me and Paul kind of broke off for a little while and started traveling on our own in our own car. And uh, one day we were doing a four-day on, one day off uh, routine, and fucking we, we, we said, you know, on that day off, we should just fucking, we should wash our clothes, you know, since our gear smells so fucking bad. And then while we, we did that, we are just like, well, now we got all these clean clothes, and I'm like, so why don't we just pack for six fucking days and wash every four? And that was like the, like the, the, the mindset of like, holy fuck, now all of a sudden, like, you're going to... to on the road for 21 days or 23 days, you got a fucking a small gear bag and a fucking and a clothes bag, and it kind of fucking like that was like a, a, like a life change revelation. Pack lighter. Yeah, like, 